In this video, I'm going to show you how you can set up and use multiple SHIB2 addresses for a customer in Sage 50. I'm already in the maintain customer screen and I've got my customer selected. And you can see here on the general tab, we can put in their, their primary address or their, or their billing address. In order to set up um, SHIB2 addresses, you have to come over to the contacts tab. And you can see the edit addresses button here. We could go in there and set up up to 20 SHIP2 addresses, but we're not going to do that yet because the key to making the SHIP2 addresses work is that you have to have a separate contact set up to go along with every SHIP2 address. So we're here on the Contacts tab. I'm going to start by clicking New Contact. And you can fill in a name here, or if you don't have a name at this location, um, you could just put in something descriptive like warehouse and just leave that as the name. Now I'm also going to copy the company name and fill it in here so that it will show up because down here we want to make sure since I just used a description in the contact name I want to make sure that we're set to use company name in the ship to address not contact name. And so that's why I took time to fill in the company name there. And then, as far as job title, phone, email, you can fill in as much of those as are relevant to this contact. Then I'm going to come over to Edit Addresses, and we'll fill in a ship to address. And let's, let's just say that their warehouse is next door to their main office. So we'll just change that address, and we'll fill in everything else the same. We'll click OK there. And then right here, now we can choose that ship to address and save the contact. So now let's see what that looks like when we're entering a transaction. So we'll go and create a quote for this customer. And you can see that now we've got warehouse as one of our choices there in the ship to address. If we created the address on the list, but not associated with a contact. It would not show up on this drop-down list right here. So that's it. That's all there is to creating multiple ship to addresses in Sage 50.